here what's poppin loyalists welcome back to the channel this is dom ZNT, aka glitch guru in today's gta 5 online video i'm going to be showing you guys how to make really dope modded outfits like you see in the thumbnail and with this glitch we're going to be using a solo director mode glitch we're going to be using a freeze mask plus the freeze joggers glitch and we can get modded outfits that are just like say wizard modded outfits or even better being as though some of the components that you can get out of director mode you can't get in save wizard all right so let's get started the very first thing that we're going to do is start out in story mode as always we're going to open up the interaction menu go down to director mode and launch it once in director mode we're going to go into our shortlist and remove anything that we don't need by hitting triangle or y if you're on xbox if you guys already have it set up with your chicken hawk and your online character then you don't have to worry about it but um, we're just going to set it up from scratch. So we're going to go into animals now. Shirtless our chicken hawk bird by hitting triangle or Y if you're on Xbox. Then we're going to back out, go into online characters. Then we're going to shirtless our online character. We will be doing this with the female character this time around. So we're just going to hit triangle to shirtless that character as well. Then exit to story mode. Once in story mode, we're going to launch a invite only session. And once we get into this invite only session, we're going to go over to the clothing store so we can purchase a standard outfit like so and go into the standard outfit category and we're going to purchase one of these standard outfits. Just make sure that it doesn't have any accessories on it like glasses or a hat. If it does, remove the accessories before you continue with the next step. So now we're going to make sure that we do have a parachute bag as well. Doesn't matter which one anyone will do. So I have a parachute as you guys can see. Now we're going to go over to the time trial. Before starting the time trial up, I'm going to make sure that I have my spawn location on last location. Then I'm going to go up to style parachute so we can force a game save. There's a number of ways you guys can force a game save. You could also change your outfit. I actually think it would be a good idea to start changing your outfits before starting the time trial up. Especially for people who can't get the birds to duplicate and who are having issues with that. Which we will have here in a second but... Once we do force a game save, we're just going to start the time trial, switch to a story mode character. And once we're in story mode, we're going to go back into director mode and see if we can get our birds to duplicate. So I do have a fix for you guys who are having issues with that. We do have an issue here with the bird not duplicating. So I'm going to show you guys what I did to fix it. So usually we would come back here into director mode, go into our short list, and then start switching between our bird and our online character. And what should happen is the bird should start duplicating. But as you guys can see, my bird wasn't duplicated. So here's what I did to fix it. I went back to story mode. From story mode, we started up another invite only session. And what we did was just open up the interaction menu, go to style. And I changed my outfit simply to another standard outfit. And that was all. The game saved. As you guys can see, the cloud saving icon showed up at the bottom right. From here, we're just going to start the time trial up once more. Hit right on the D-pad wait for it to start then switch to our story mode character and then once we're in story mode launch director mode so this was a very simple fix and after this i didn't have any issues with the bird not duplicating so we're back into the short list i'm going to switch between my bird and my online character and you should see your bird now duplicating so we need our birds to duplicate as long as it takes for our character to jump on top of the haystack which normally takes around 26 minutes so it always takes me about 26 minutes before my character jumps on top of the haystack so we're going to fast forward it and we will be back you guys could go afk but you want to be around for this next step when your character jumps on top of the haystack which is right now 26 minutes later my character jumped right on top of the haystack right on cue and what we're going to do now is over duplicate our burst so this doesn't happen we don't want to jump back over to the trailer right there like you saw my character do that's what we're trying to prevent that's what makes us lose our modded outfits even when we're switching through our modded outfits that's what's happening that makes us lose our modded outfits so we're over duplicating we're just going to do that a few more times land on our bird then we're going to hit triangle you guys want to do this part fairly quickly hit triangle circle back out go into actors beach bums and press square to change your appearance so we want to see if we have modded outfits now and we do so once we have these modded outfits all we're going to do is we're going to be looking for an outfit that has a Christmas mask on it that we want to freeze. Also, there's a little technique I like to do to make sure that my modded outfits don't disappear. And that's what you guys see me doing right here. I'm just going down to Muscle Sands, each of these categories, pressing square to change my appearance to make sure that the modded outfits stick around. Because usually when we stay in one category for too long, pressing square, 
then we try to switch to a different category and press square that's when we lose our modded outfits so just make sure that your modded outfits are sticking around so i'm going to look for an outfit that has a christmas mask on it i have one in my recently used list so it's okay to use this so that's what i'm going to do right here instead of looking for one so this is going to save us a lot of time so i'm going to go into my recently used list hit triangle to shortlist it that's going to put this outfit into our shortlist and now we can use this to freeze it so i'm gonna back out go into my shortlist actors remove my online character now that i'm positive that my modded outfits are sticking around then we're going to do our freeze mask glitch which is just simply hovering over this outfit in our shortlist backing out going into actors beach bombs down into muscle sands hitting square to change our appearance it doesn't matter which one of these categories we use when we go into beach bombs to change our appearance as long as we change our appearance period so we're just going to keep doing this until our Christmas mask is frozen. We're going to go back into our shirt list, hover over that outfit for a split second or two, back out, go into actors, beach bombs, down to any one of these categories, press square to change our appearance a couple of times and see if our Christmas mask is frozen. Now this part right here could take anywhere between 15 minutes to an hour or two hours sometimes, depending on how fast you're doing it, how consistent you're going into your shirt list and backing out and going into actors to change your appearance so i got it in actually about 30 minutes so 30 minutes later i'm about to freeze this christmas mask i'm just doing the same steps over and over again and we're just going to continue to do this over and over again no matter how long it takes until our christmas mask is frozen but our target goal is about 15 to 30 minutes and i seem to always hit it within 30 minutes so right there guys i'm pressing square to change my appearance and my christmas mask is frozen now what we want to do is look for an outfit that has the joggers that we want to freeze or whatever bottom that you guys would like to try to freeze so i'm gonna freeze some blue joggers in this case so i'm gonna just keep searching till i find blue joggers then i'm gonna shortlist those once i go into my shortlist i'm going to remove the other outfit that i had in there now we should only have one outfit inside of our shortlist with the Christmas mask on it and the joggers that we want to freeze. So we're going to do the same exact method for freezing the Christmas mask. We're just going to go into our shortlist, back out, go into actors, beach bombs, down to muscle sands, hit square to change our appearance and see if the Christmas mask with the joggers are frozen. If not, we're just going to back out and continue to do it over and over again until it happens. Freezing the joggers only takes about 15 to 20 minutes. It's a lot easier than freezing the Christmas mask. So once you guys do freeze the joggers, you might freeze the wrong color. All you need to do is just go back into your shortlist and do the freeze again until you guys freeze the correct color. And that's all it takes to freeze the joggers with the Christmas mask. So now what I'm going to do is just look for an outfit that I like. I suggest that you guys take your time with this right here. Look for something really dope, something that matches. And once we have it, we're going to shortlist it. And then I'll show you guys what it looks like in the shortlist and then we'll take it online. All right, so this is the outfit that I chose. Um, it's not exactly what I wanted, but it is pretty dope. We put the IAA badge on it as well. To get the IAA badge, all you guys need to do is land on the outfit with the IAA badge, then go into your shortlist, and then it will transfer over to every outfit inside of your shortlist. So now that we have this, we're just gonna hit X while hovering over it inside of our shortlist. That's gonna take us into director mode with this outfit. We're just going to sit in director mode for about 20 to 30 seconds while wearing this outfit. Then we're going to hold down on the D-pad and switch to a story mode character. Once in story mode with this outfit, we're going to open up our phone, go to quick save, and we're going to just save this progress that we did. We don't want to lose anything that we created in our shortlist. This way, whenever we close the GTA 5 application and come back into the game, we can just load that game save, go into our shortlist, and all of those outfits will be there. And we can bring some of those online as long as they have the penguin mask on it or the elf mask without glasses. So after waiting around for 20 to 30 seconds in story mode, all we're going to do is start up an invite only session. And once you're in that invite only session, you should notice that you have on the outfit that we selected. And boom, we have this outfit. Really dope. Blue joggers, IAA badge. Not exactly what I was looking for, but hey, man, beggars cannot be choosers. And it's really dope, actually. So really clean looking modded outfit all we're going to do now is go down to the clothing store and save this outfit so that's it for this glitch you guys if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you're new 
Remember that the elf mask without glasses and the penguin mask is the only ones that we can use to go back and get multiple outfits. So keep that in mind. That's what I use. That way, whenever I want to try to go back and get another outfit, my outfits will be there. For the most part, they will be the same. We'll at least have the joggers. But um, that's it for this video. As always, we're trying to get this channel up to 100,000 subscribers. And I need each and every single one of you guys watching to do me a favor. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications if you're new so you never miss a single video. Share this video with a friend. Please help me help you, you guys. And keep bringing you these great GTA 5 online videos. Until next time, this is your boy, Glitch Guru. Officially, ew. Peace. Remember, stay loyal. And click one of those videos on the screen, bro. What you wait for? God damn, he got colored jerseys. He got white duffel bags. Damn. <laughs>